When you walked in this morning, there was something on your seat, and it's called, What's Your Shape? Now, when our worship team walked in this morning and they saw that, some of them are a little kind of smarty, you know, and they said, well, how offensive is that? You asking me, what's my shape? It has nothing to do with your physique. But it has everything to do with how God made you uniquely you. The S stands for spiritual gifts. The H stands for heart or passion. If you and I sat down over coffee and we were to begin to talk, if you were at my kitchen table and we were having a conversation, we began to talk, there could be some things that as I spoke to you, you would you would become more animated. You would become more energized. You, you would become more excited about those things. They can tell this is what you're passionate about. This is what your heart is driven to. The A stands for abilities. God has enabled you, given you abilities. Some of you are able to work with your hands. Some of you are very sharp with your minds. Some of you know all this technical stuff that goes on. You have all kinds of abilities. The P stands for personality. Some of you think, well, I know some people who don't have one. No, everybody's got a personality. Some of us are more introverted. Some stand out and like loud and proud, big and in charge. What's your personality? I love the letter E because it stands for experiences. And this is such a great reminder that God doesn't waste anything in our life. Whatever he's allowed us to experience, good or bad, he can use for his glory. You have life experiences that you have lived that maybe other people have not lived. And so what we're going to ask you to do is scan this QR code. There is a shape profile And you can just take it right there on your device. I said that in the first service, and every student whipped that phone out. and (laughs) I mean, they were doing it. I had to say, could you wait until you're on Pastor Stephen Savage's time in the second hour? Amen? Not mine. No, I was kidding. But, But if you'll scan that, take that, because here's what we desire. We want to empower you with your purpose. We want to help you know how God has uniquely shaped you so that you can live for something bigger than yourselves. You can do something that matters, that has an eternal difference. Imagine you were created to serve God and to serve other people. And God has done more than just giving you a spiritual gift. He made you who you are. And he can use you in a powerful way.